Dan die Tessa, jy mag so lang begin. Oké, okay, ek is nou weer, kan ek my pointer aanset? Zij. Good morning! It is a cold Thursday morning today. It is Thursday, the 14th of May, 2020, and I hope you are ready for our mathematics lesson. Let's get started. Have a look at yesterday's homework. Let's check your answers. I'm going to revise them with you again. Have your pencil ready and then you mark your homework. Tens and units when we uh, plus 71 plus 22. We do the units first. We say 1 plus 2 equals 3. 7 plus 2 equals no oh, equals 9 sorry for that so the answer is 93 now 55 plus 30 5 plus 0 equals 5 and 5 plus 3 equals 8 oh, let me just get my mouse my mouse is cold it wants to run away you don't laugh at me Yanni. okay let's do 20 plus 90 2, 0 plus 9 equals 9. Better. 2 plus 1 equals 3. Have you got that correct? If it's correct, you make a tick. The last one on the plus, 4 plus 2 equals 6. And 4 plus 3 equals 7. Now we are moving on to subtraction, where we minus 7. First, the units, remember, 7 minus 6 leaves us with 1. And 7 minus 6 leaves us another 1. So the answer is 11. 89 minus 54. The 9 take away the 4. And it leaves us with 5. And 8 take away 5 leaves us with Three. Are you marking? 75 take away 25. 5 take away 5 is 0. And 7 take away 2 is 5. Now, this is an, a, a, a one that is going to be a bit harder. What do we do if we plus, and it's 34 plus 16, and we have 4 plus 6. 4 plus 6 equals 10. And remember, we are not allowed to write 10 or 2 numbers in the block. So we write down the 0. And we carry the 1 over to the 10s. And then we add them all up. We say that 1 plus 3 equals 4. And plus that 1 equals 5. In subtraction, we do it this way. The units... We see that 8 is too small to take away 9. So I go to my neighbor and I'm going to borrow from the 6, which is 60. It's the 6 tens. And he, if he is giving 1 ten away, it leaves 5. And he gives that 1 ten over to the 8, which makes it 18. So 18 minus 9 equals 9. And 5 minus 4 equals, 5 minus 1 equals 4. That's our answers from yesterday's work, and I hope you have them all correct. Today, we are going to, uh, to do addition and subtraction. But because it's so cold, we need to do a counting warm-up. Are you ready? We are going to count from 2 to 200, the even numbers. That is the same as we count in twos. Let's start. Right. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. I want to show you something. Just stop quickly. Can you see when you say two, four, six, eight, ten? Then you go to twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. It's a repetition. We just repeat the 2, the 4, the 6, the 8, and the 10. And then we move on to the next line, adding one number 
on like one thing so after there's your tens for 12 and there's 20 30 and we keep on doing the two the four the six the eight and the ten we call it the repetition there's a pattern in this counting we have stopped at 20 and now we are going on please count with me 22 24 i can't see you counting 26 28 30 32 34 36 38 40 42 44 46 48 50 52 54 56 58 60 62 64 66 68 70 72 74 76 78 80 82 84 86 88 90 come on let's count you're not gonna warm up 92 94 96 98 100 100 102 104 106 108 110 112 114 116 118 120 122 124 126 128 130 good keep on 132 134 136 138 140 142 144 146 148 150 152 154 156 158 160 162 164 166 168 170 keep on don't get tired now we're almost there 172 174 176 178 180 182 184 186 188 100 and 90, 192, 194, 196, 198, 200. Hooray! Now we are warm and ready for our lesson today. Look at this number block. What do you see here? There are numbers from one, two, three, and now there's, a, there's open spaces, and we need to fill up the open spaces. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Now we are going to skip and we're going to start at 62. After 62, we get 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69. Okay, question. What did you notice here? What happened? That's right. They are all uneven numbers yes uneven numbers now, let's name them 5 7 9 13 15 17 19 63 65 67 69 what is an uneven number again can you remember yes it's when two cannot divide into that number we are going on and today we're going to do some sums on the number line this is fun i hope that when you do this please watch first a number line always starts with zero when you 
draw a number line. You start with zero, you make your line and this one goes up to 30. Right, this is the sum, 13 plus 12. Now we want to find the answer. The number line helps us, it makes us easy. First of all, you go and you find 13. Can you see? Here is 13. Now we are going to add 12 on. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And we land on? That's right. We land on 25. And you are writing the answer down. So now we know on the number line, then we make a long skip. And can you see the line? You take the line, you make a long jump. The frog is leaping from 13 and then we add 12 on. So the answer is 25. It lands on 25 so that we know that 13 plus 12 equals 25. Now we are going to carry on the same thing. Remember we start at naught and the sum is 14 plus 12. So you find 14. Here's 14, can you see it? There's it. Now we are going to count 12 on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. And that brings us to the answer of 26. Are you with me still? That's it. Oh, sorry, 26. Oops. I'm going to make a cross. It's not right. 26. Sorry. The next one, 19 plus L plus 11. First, you are going right to find 19. Here is 19. And you leap up to 19. And from there are you do counting. I just want to close this because, right. Are you ready? 19 plus 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. The answer is 30. On the number line, it shows the answer easy. Next one, start. Always start from zero, find my 16, because that's my sum. 16 plus 13, you will add on 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 is here on 29. And then you leap, make the frog jump to the two numbers. And the answer is 20. Nine. It's easy the answers, you just have to do your counting correctly. Now 15 plus 14, find 15. Got it? Yes, 15. And now we are going to add 14 on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And my answer again is... 29. Woo. Right, now we are going to do subtraction, but I want to go first to the addition. Remember the name addition. It means if I take plus 13 and 12 together, what is happening? My answer is getting bigger. So there's my naught and the bigger is moving to the right. So your answer is, is Answers is growing bigger because we plus. But with subtraction, we are mo moving to the opposite way. We are going smaller and that side to the zero, that's smaller. So we go from the right back to the left. This is the sum. 
14 take away 4. It's going, so my answer must get smaller. You go and you find 14. You see? Now you take 4 away. 1, 2, 3, 4. My answer is 10. Do you see this sum? There's no sum in it. No problem. Then we go and you look at your number line. You start at the back. What is that? That is 16. You see it? 16. Take away. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 16. Take away 6. Now we are going to jump it. 16. Jump. Take away 6. Where do we land? We land on the pen. Yoo-hoo! Easy, easy. It's minus subtraction, so we move back to the smaller numbers. We're going backwards. No, we don't have a, a sum here. No problem. We go to the 18, the last number. Here it is. We say 18, and we start with 18, the bigger number. Then we are going to minus, let's count, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Well done. It is 8. And on which number did it land? On 10. Oh, this number line helps us. It gives us the answers if we count correctly. We are going to look at this one. We look at the last number. It is 14. I didn't remove 14. And how many are we going to take away? One, two, three. No, no, no. It's 13. I didn't look correctly. It's mistakes. No problem. It is 13. Can you see? Here is 13. We're going to take away one, two, and three. And I land on the answer, 10. Good. A problem solving. Problems is normally a sum that is written in words, like Liza has 17 counters. She lost eight. The word lost means minus. She's going to give it away. She's going to lose them. She's not going to keep on having 17. She's going to have less now. Now you just check if we do, how many counters do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Yes, we do have 17 counters. Now she's going to lose some. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Now we, let's see how many is left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So how many counters does she have left? Nine. I want you to do this worksheet. You can take a snapshot quickly and then you can email your answers to me. I'm just going to help you with the first one. Yeah, this number line is a little bit more difficult than the other one because it ha it's not numbered. But it helps us. It's, it starts with naught. Then we have 10 there and we have 20 there. Okay, now we look at 25. So there's 20. We are going to add 5 on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Can you see? Yeah. How many are we going now to subtract from, from 25? We're going to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So we land here. 
Now you see. Now, on what number is that? We work it out. You find out. If that is 10, that will be 11, 12, and that, that one which they landed on will be 13. And that is the way we do subtraction on the number line. So they are yours to do for homework. Can you see? There's no sum written down for you. Remember, no problem. The previous slides showed us what to do. You look at that number, you count. Why, where does it start? And you subtract going backwards to naught. Then you can copy your sum down there. Good luck with it. I will see it tomorrow when we do the marking. Well done so far. My takeaway message to you today is, ha, huh, you like it? Then you, we will see you tomorrow again at 10 o'clock for the next numeracy lesson. And we will do some more number lines. If there's any questions, you can ask, ask me now. I'm here and I will try and answer them for you. Put up your hands if there's something you want to ask me. Crystal, you wanna, is there anything you wanna ask? Do, do you understand the number line? Uh, with the robot. Yes, ma'am, do I do. Oh, I'm so glad and I'm so happy. So you won't have problems in doing your homework. Then. Yes, a lot. I won't. Good. Okay. Okay, who raised hands there? Let me see. Ma'am, see you tomorrow. Hi, and Nomonde, you want to ask me? Is there something Nomonde want to X. ask? Yes? No. Um, is there anything? Is that hand just a goodbye wave? Good. Okay, then, if there's really nothing you want to ask me, we will see tomorrow. Um, yes, I'm still here. Ask. The number line one I liked the most, and you. the numbers were a bit difficult. Is it a little bit difficult? Don't don't yeah. stress about don't stress about it. You if you take a snapshot, you can try it because things are difficult if we don't try. Try your best. Do what I, you want to slice, what I've told you to do. Look at, go back and, and see your slides again. And you will follow the explanation. And then you do it accordingly to that. Okay. Try it. And tomorrow, yes. we will do, we will do some more. The crime part, it was just to my baby sister. Okay. The crime part, it was just to my baby sister. Okay. So. We will see tomorrow and then we can mark our work and then we can solve the problem soon. Okay. I'm going to unmute. Okay. I'm going to mute. Yes. Right. Any serious things you want to ask for, for the last time? Nothing. Thank you so much then. No. See You're tomorrow. welcome. Oh, you're welcome too. Thank See you so tomorrow. much.